U.S. defense contractor Northrop Grumman is continuing to deliver the XM 913 50mm cannon to the U.S. even as the service continues to consider its cannon caliber requirements for the vehicle that will eventually replace the aging M2 Bradley fighting. The 50mm cannon combines Bushmaster chain gun reliability with next-generation effective range that will provide the warfighter with increased standoff against near-peer adversaries. The Bushmaster chain gun has been tested as a counter-rocket, artillery and mortar and counter-unmanned aerial vehicle weapon. It was initially developed under the Extended Area Protection and Survivability Integrated Demonstration. Last year the Army began testing the new 50mm cannon that would be used for its next-generation combat vehicle and a live fire demonstration was held at Northrop Grumman's 2019 Bushmaster User Conference in Kingman. Has been subsequently tested in tracking distant moving target by utilizing interferometric radar as a sensor, fire control computer and a radio frequency transmitter and receiver to launch a course correcting projectile. The Army has been working with Northrop Grumman to further develop the cannon to support its NGCV program and range over existing weapons. A decided emphasis for the Army's NGCV is speed, maneuverability and expeditionary warfare. New cannon, new ammunition. The XM913 cannon can fire two types of munitions including XM1204 high explosive airburst with trace an XM1203 armor-piercing fin stabilized discarding sabot with trace. This has been described as central to the Army's advanced lethality and accuracy system for medium-caliber efforts. The Alas MC was designed to allow gunners to be more agile and to fire with higher accuracy, even along further distances. The combination of enhancements not only give gunners greater versatility, but we anticipate that overall gunner operations could be as much as three times faster. The Alas MC is also expected to provide superior medium caliber weapon system performance and lethality as compared to currently fielded systems worldwide. Moreover, it is designed to provide greater target standoff, improved precision and accuracy. Another key aspect of the Alas MC development is that it is using a development model aimed at future system growth that can be adapted for future technologies that enable multi-role missions.